How's it going guys? Welcome back to A to Z Ozone. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install a Venturi onto your faucet. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. So here are all the parts uh, together when they are assembled. Um, first you'll need a one half by one half inch MPT female brass fitting. Then you have your half inch Venturi injector. And then you have a one half inch MPT fe uh, female coupling. And then a one half inch MPT by three eighths uh, barb hose. So these are all the parts you'll need and this is what it looks like when you have them all together. Um, we have everything held together with some plumber's tape to make sure everything's nice and tight and that there's no leakage within the parts itself. So once everything's assembled, you want to make sure that it's attached properly to your sink. And to do so, you're going to have to test it. So we're going to screw it on. And to test it, what you're going to do is, once it's on, you're going to place your finger on this nozzle when the water's running. When your finger's on the nozzle, there should be a more laminar flow, and laminar is just a smoother water flow. So we're gonna test it. So it seems to be on all right. And then the last step is to place the hose onto the venturi, and then it will come out your hose. Another extra step you can do is placing a flow meter onto the Venturi. So what you're gonna do is attach it right here and when the water is on you will see that it measures the flow rate of the water. Down a little bit. And that's how you install a Venturi onto your faucet.